Uh, what's up everybody? Raven here, and today we are back in Civilization 5. And today we're going to hopefully take over those people in the south, or at least find somebody. Um, still our main goal is finding people, but uh, and hopefully get a, another few cities up in the north. Yeah, that would be very nice. Alright, so let's continue our journey. Alright, let's see how we are right now. Wow, this is this map's actually turning out pretty nice. You can actually see all of North America. Very nice, very nice. Well, unless you're some of those people that consider uh, what you call it down here, this little strip part here. Uh, load, dang it, thank you. Uh, <laughs> this area right here, uh, you know, I still call Central America. I don't do the whole Middle America. Then you do the whole Second Central. That's all crap. I mean, seriously. And let me just quickly readjust the mic a little bit, because it looks like you guys are not getting a full amount. I mean, I know you, I, my voice alone is not good enough for y'all, but whatever. So, let's see. So, we have these people in the north that we're solving problems with. Uh, let's see. So, yes. Our warriors by themselves, I don't think would be very good at taking them out. However, we could take out their spearmen. Uh... And then hopefully, yeah, that's what we'll do. We'll take out the spearmen, and then we'll get them to heal. Now, I don't know how well the sound of the game's coming in. I'm not sure if I actually had to take that out or not. Uh, mostly because the sound was having a negative impact in the last video. When I was editing it, it just would not, uh, you know, differentiate between the two. So, I had to make some check cuts. I'm horrible. Okay, so, as I said, I want to start moving down towards this area, especially since there's gems. I want to put up a city right here. So, let's see here. We have one set of barbarians. And our spearmen are actually quite injured, and they're out of moves. Okay. Well, it looks like actually everything else is done. So, I'm guessing we should probably switch to next turn. Okay. Come on. City states, let's go. Alright, they left my people alone. Oh, because they're attacking something. Alright. And oh come on no no come on you can do it you can do it come on come on push them back don't let them get us ah oh, damn so wait did they dot and now these people are attacking me I thought they were just attacking the people to the south maybe the south people attacked them that might be it all right so did my people in the north actually die no they did not they survived and they spawned more people. So, it would look like we should... Oh, wait, which... Okay, I apparently was picking the wrong person just now. <laughs> it's just, uh... Alright, look, focus. We need these people. Alright, so... I know when I've lost a match, and this is definitely not my best one, so we are going to... Oh, crap. They can't swim? My people can't swim! Okay. If that's the case, they're not going to be able to make it out. And those people are going to kill us. So, well, <clears throat> we will go down fighting. We will not die. Oh, we're probably going to die. There's two of them. Yeah. 20 gold. Just enough to rep uh, replace him, I think. I don't remember. Okay. So, we have this warship doing absolutely nothing at the moment. We need... I mean, I guess it could continue down the coast. That would probably be a good idea. Now, I've been killing barbarians. Am I good? Alright, so we're good friends with uh, Valletta, but we're still not their allies. I'm not sure why. Uh... Oh, that's why. You need, uh, I think, double the, the uh, minimum before allies. 
Very well. Okay, so. What to do now? Alright, we'll start scouting that area down there. Let's send the ship down. Now, why couldn't the, you know, warriors go into the water? Maybe it was, that was the ocean? Because I know these guys went through the water. Huh. Let's do it! Hiya! Oh! Yeah! You meant the city state of Sidon. Or Sidon. We'll go with Sidon. They provided me the gift of 15 gold. Well, that's nice. Thank you, man. Alright, now. How's Kyoto doing? We're okay, we're good on food. So that's fine. I wish we could make marketplaces. How long until we can make those, actually? I not, not marketplaces, the uh, trading posts. Let's see here. Research info. Research that. Uh, I guess it might be a bit further down the road than I thought. What's well, okay? It's yeah. We're gonna have to go through here, through here, and that. That's uh, that's a bit more than I want to do at the moment. But oh well, we should be fine for now. We have enough gold to last us. So now that we got our spearmen in a good position. Um, we're going to want to put a city near the gems, actually. Put them right between the two city states. That should provide us with enough defense from them. So we won't even have to supply them with the military. Uh, at least that's what I'm hoping for. Okay. And you need to order. Let's just put everyone to. Actually, do we have it? We don't even have any roads, do we? Do we have that road? Now I said I want a road up in that area, but we have barbarians and cantonments. So, let's instead have... He's already making a road. Okay. Uh, let's see here. We'll move him to here. We'll just make some more farms. Why not? Okay. That's done. This guy, we'll send him up to actually take out that encampment because that could prove disastrous for us. So let's just go kill them off. And next turn. And yes, I am aware that we are probably going to die. Wait, public declaration from the Kel... Boudica... Uh, um, uh, yeah, Boudica. <laughs> Booty. Uh, the Great of the Celts. Oh, she's Celtic. Okay, I definitely got to become her friend. So, by Celt, I'm taking it, that means, you know, Scots and everything else. So, yeah, we're going to want to become their friends. I do not, uh, you never want to be on the wrong end of a sword against a Celt or a Scot or an Irishman. So, I'm going to try and become their friend. Well met, fellow warrior. I am Boudicca, Lord of the Celtic Peoples. May we be allies in this turbulent world. Yes. Yes, allies would be a good thing. And oh my god, she has So she is from South America. She's. Oh, uh, don't tell me she got those gems in her resources. That would piss me off. Okay, uh. Hmm. Yeah. Let us trade some. What? Yeah, we're, we're new friends. What do you give me for wine? Oh. Uh, really? But. Oh. Uh, accept embassy. For, uh, you don't have the ability to make even embassies. Uh huh. Well, uh, goodbye. So, where the hell is she, her? Okay, so that's her military there, the Celtic warrior. Okay. I wonder how they fare with Sidonian people. And I guess these are the ones defending, uh... Oh, no! Uh, the inevitable has happened. Okay, let's make a lumber mill here. Let's have this ship continue south. Because now we know there's a sieve. We've, we completed one of our objectives for the day. 
We found another sieve. Okay. This guy who is all but dead will start to heal. Okay. Let's have... Oh, that's right. That guy's already moving, so I don't have to really worry about him. Although, our military is starting to not fare out so well. So we're going to really want those... Uh, pretty much anything to get us money at this point. Okay. But, yes, yeah, so this gems are still uncalled for, which is nice. Although, if I put my city down here... Oh, wait, what? We'd like to set up an embassy in your capital. What do you think? Yes! Wait, what? I said yes. Oh, I can't make embassy. She can't... Okay, I, I get it now. I think. I don't know. We'd like to set up an embassy in your capital. What do you think? One gold per turn or an embassy. I accept. Well, that's nice. And, yeah, she runs off in this direction. So, now ever, now that she runs off, I can see a little bit of a city border here. So, I'm going to take it. That means that she's going to be in the other land. Well, I'm going to be established in other capitals. Okay, and she ran off. But I can get her on the diplomatic people. Miss Boudica. Go on. Oh, okay. I see how it is. Uh, fine. Trade. I want you to accept my embassy now. And I will give you... Ooh, I don't want to give her one gold per turn for 25 turns. That's that's kind of, kind of killing me. Let's go with... Yeah, you know what? She gave me one gold per turn. I'll give her one gold per turn. Goodbye. Well, apparently everything's working out very well for us. <laughs> Okay, let's continue this ship down towards the bay. Choose research. Uh, let's see, what do we need now? Um, da, 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 da. Let me think. All right, in order to make a guild, we're going to need mathematics, currency, um, and, okay, so just straight through. So we can go with the whole mathematics roots. That's fine. Okay. And, oh, this guy can keep moving. Yep, right through their land. Don't worry about us. Damn, they're, they're pretty good. They got crabs everywhere. Good job, Valetta. Okay, next turn. <sighs> so yeah, we found a new sieve. She is the Celts. And apparently so far she's being quite friendly. Uh, as long as, you know, I'm going to probably tell you that she means, you know, she's down here in the south, we're up in the north, we should both be fine, and, uh, Terracotta Army creates, creates a copy of each type of military land unit you control and places the unit near the city where the Terracotta Army is constructed. Ah. Oh. Regard your soldiers as your children, and they will follow you into the deepest valleys. Look on them as your own beloved sons, and they will stand by you even unto death. Sun Tzu. Okay, that's pretty awesome. If I, you know, I just have to admit. Um, so that's the Terracotta Army. Which means I believe, yep, I was on who built it, which is awesome. Now let's see if I can find it in here. Um, oh, I'm going to take it to these people down here, because they're all in lines. So, so yeah. All right, that's pretty cool. Nice little wonder. And now that that's done, we're going to want to build that settler unit so we can start getting those other cities I wanted done. Um, these guys are still moving to the north, which is good. Um, we're going to want to send these guys over that way. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa. Oh, okay, I get it. So since I already had uh, some spearmen and warriors, it gave me two free units of them. Awesome. Uh, yeah, that's definitely going to help us. Okay, so... I'm trying to think. Do we want to move these guys downwards or northwards? Let's send the other group of spearmen to the north. So those ones are going that way. We're going to want to finish out that other encampment over this way. 
Yeah, by the silver. So, right. What the hell was that other encampment? I don't even see it on the map. Oh, that's right. We actually got rid of the encampment. It's just some barbarians up there. Then in that case, we really don't need to worry about them. So, in that case, let's just... Eh, we'll just keep them on alert for now. We have nowhere for them to actually need to go. Uh, those ones are moving north. Yeah, it needs orders. Who else needs orders? Okay, our ship. Let's continue on our voyage. We have met Vancouver. We have met the city of Vancouver. They give me 15 gold. Close. Ah, that's nice. And you know what I just realized? There is no city-state in the entire North American continent, unless you count this right here, which... I'm, I think that's more like Panama right there. So... I mean, if I count uh, Central America as North America, then I guess uh, we would have one city-state. But in general, we don't have any city-states in North America, yet she, Miss Edinburgh lady, has all these other ones. So, yeah, we're going to want to become real good on her side, or else this is going to be brutal on us. Uh, what's this? Celts are protecting Vancouver. You have met the city of Vancouver. Okay. Uh, we'll just keep this on alert. Alright, another unit needs orders. I don't think so. Next turn. Alright. So far, so good. Uh, okay, wait. Okay, uh, for some reason I thought they just attacked me. And I was like, uh, why? <laughs> that would not be something I want. Okay. Oh, Barbarian came in discovered. Ah! Okay. Uh, why? That can't happen. Hmm. Okay, so. This is going to be our main target we got to deal with. So, let us... Hmm. Okay, we already have our... Trade routes between two civilizations can yield food... Uh, let's go. I'll build a cargo ship. That should be fine. And this encampment we gotta deal with. So, where, oh, where is the nearest units? Okay. Send the spearmen down. I know the Japanese are supposed to be considered highly for their samurai, but until we get those, spearmen it is. So, spearmen. Launch an attack. Wait, we're going across the water? That doesn't even. That doesn't even make logical sense. Whatever. You don't need orders. Okay, now that we've found them, we're gonna try not to go in their land. So, go that way. Yeah, and then we'll just stay on alert for now. Okay. And let's start moving this ship downward. Actually, we've already gone downward. I wonder if I can shoot anything from here. I doubt it. Uh, nope, can't. That's right, these ones can only shoot in the water. So in that case, we'll just continue moving south. Okay, so far so good. And those guys are going to deal with that. That's doing that. And everything else is doing just handy dandy. So let's just get rid of that. Let's zoom out for a moment. Uh, the Great Library has been built in a faraway land. Okay. That's fine, I guess. I mean, what if I wanted it? But whatever. Uh, ooh, new unit from Valletta. Cheers, Valletta. Hey, buddy, what did what, you give me? Some swordsmen. Oh, that's hilarious. Since I was just talking about, you know, samurai. I guess swordsmen are the next best thing. All right. So let's just send these guys... Uh, down here, just be some border patrol. I mean, this mountain range right here is like the perfect defense line. I mean, we can, nothing can get across it, so you have to go through the water no matter what, which is very nice. Uh, let's just send these guys across the Letta's little island tip thing. Okay. Uh, so, says Valletta is going to be a new unit. Now, uh, for those of you who are wondering why I'm, you know, 
not knowing some of these people. Uh, I have uh, two, I believe, two add-ons for this game. Uh, we have the Kings, uh, you know, I think it's Angels and Kings or Angel, uh, Kings and Gods, and uh, the other massive one. So, I can't think of it for the life of me right now. Uh, sorry. Okay, these guys are ready to attack, aren't they? Charge! Oh, 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 come on, come on. Yeah. Alright, these guys are just sitting here doing absolutely nothing. Let's continue this way. Yeah, these orders, uh, these guys are done with that. Let's have, let's have another farm. Because I'm going to want to start building a bigger army. So, farm, 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 this one. There. Okay. So let them get out of the farm. Our, look at this. Our, our little citizen's getting, you know, we're getting there. And down here, we're also, you know, stretching out. All right. Next turn. I'm quite interested in what Edinburgh people are going to be doing. Wish I could see. Hmm. Uh, religion founded. An unknown civilization found a new religion of Buddhism in their cities. Okay. And, wait. Have we actually... Oh, yeah, we did. We actually did uh, create a religion. That's that's good. Alright. Osaka's grown. Uh, barbarian encampment has been discovered. Good lord. How many encampments are going to be discovered? And it's that one we had uh, to deal with before. So, we're going to send some people over there. Probably just like keep them right there to uh, hold that zone. So we'll send uh, some warriors over. Let them deal with them. Okay. These swordsmen. Uh, swordsmen can actually probably get up there pretty quick. I'm going to think about it, but whatever. Let's have them go into the water. Uh, get rid of that. Get these orders. And of course, they're going to start spawning things to defend them. Should have known. To your attack. Oof. That looked like a really painful attack for us. Okay. Uh, These people can start moving again. You all go here. And then I have that other ship I need to move. Come on, move. Move. Alright, yeah, you guys. Let's just. Because I don't really want to go through your land. Don't want to piss you guys off right now. Let's go downwards. Oh, look at that. She even has ships. Oh, they're cargo ships. So I wonder if she's going to start trying to trade with me since, uh... Oh, no, wait. No, wait. Oh, she's trading with, uh, Vancouver. Oh. Well, that's right. We can trade with, uh, city-states, can't we? Okay, that'd be nice. So get our cargo ship. Just go to Valletta. That's, like, the quickest trade route for us. All right. Uh, next turn. Alright, now that you need orders. Uh, ooh. Let's go to land so they can't just get sunk. Uh, they're going to probably attack us first, but who cares? We'll get them done later. Alright, so, uh, it does look like it's that time again. Uh, I'm going to have to end this video here. Uh, we've actually, you know, got quite a few things done. We found another sieve, and yeah. So far, everything's going quite well for us. So, I will catch everyone in the next episode. Goodbye.